do, but what do, but what do, but what do. Sliding back onto my channel like I haven't done a video for the last six months. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Happy 2023! And I am so sorry there has been a lack of videos, but oh my god, there's been a lot to unpack. Welcome to my channel. I am in my second year of BA acting and stage combat at East 15. And let me tell you, when they say second year is the one that will break you, the stress is here. And the stress is real. But that is okay because we are hitting the ground running and we are plowing into the work. So I guess a little bit of a recap of what's been going on. As you can see, Farah, you are no longer in student halls. No, I am not. I finally moved into my first house. It's been great. I love where I live. My room is a lot bigger and I have a double bed, which I'm so happy about because nothing says upgrading from being a student to having your single bed that could barely hold a dormouse to having a double bed, which all five foot three of me can just starfish. And yes, the last time that you saw me on this channel, I was just finishing my first year priority week in Broadsword and Quarterstaff and also doing my immersive theatre module. We're in turn two of second year now and a lot of stuff has happened. I started learning Sword and Shield, which was amazing. I had such a good time. Definitely the most challenging weapon system I have ever had to tackle because it was heavy, like heavy. And we had to learn a very specific way of holding the sword and the shield, our footwork. Let me tell you, if you're ever wanting to do stage combat, just be prepared that you will spend 70% of your course in a squat position and there is nothing that you can do about it and you'll get used to it, but it's fine. Sword and Shield was great. I did a scene from Henry VI part one and I was partnered with Bodhi. I was playing Joan of Arc and he was playing Charles Dauphin. We smashed the crap out of each other and all safety because safety is important. So we had Sword and Shield as part of our combat assessment, but also they decided to throw something else into the mix and combine our acting assessment for Shakespeare with our combat exam. So not only were we being assessed on our combat abilities and how we carry the scene with our physicality, we were also being graded on our acting skills and how we marry the two together to create a scene that is both quality of acting and quality of combat. So no pressure, it was bloody hard. But we pulled through, the class had a great time and I got to look like a freaking badass with a sword and shield in my hand, which I was a very big fan of. I'm enjoying my time playing these characters whilst I can. So yeah, sword and shield is done now. Now we're in term two and we are now moving on to 18th century small sword, which is so different, <laughs> like so different. I've really had to get used to the footwork because we have gone from being in a low squat position to being very wide and moving through space with a very wide stance to now being in a linear stance with hands sticking out straight. And we have ballet class on a Monday morning. Yes, I know, it makes me very tired just thinking about it. But it's been a lot of fun. My legs are burning by the time it is 11.20 and I just want to sleep after that. <laughs> but no, I'm really happy with how ballet is going. Now, when you get into second year, it's when you start working towards your bigger modules of plays and really getting into the nitty gritty of text work. So we are doing our Shakespeare plays at the moment. The boys will be doing As You Like It and we are doing Romeo and Juliet. Now, those of you who've been on the channel for quite some time know that when I was back on Sir, we also did a version of Romeo and Juliet on Zoom. And I've also done Romeo and Juliet at GCC, so I feel like this play is just following me through my life and I'm never gonna be able to escape it, but that's okay. We like the play, we know the play well, so learning lines has actually been a lot easier. So I'm feeling very positive about this Shakespeare unit. We have about four and a half weeks or so until our priority week. So we're just hitting the ground running with learning lines. I'm really excited for you to meet new people coming onto my channel, new friends, new course mates, new people that have joined the school because of course I am now a second year, which means that we have the new first year. I am now a combat mother mentor and, to, and the fact that I am a combat mother means that I have a mentee in the year below me who is older than me, which you know, makes me a little bit sad because I thought I would at least have age and height on my side, but I have neither of those things with my combat son, so. Thanks, Ethan. But yeah, my combat son is doing very, very well and I'm making sure that I give him all the advice that I can give and he's doing very well. And I love that we have that kind of mentor system in the school because it's just a nice way to socialize with people. Feeling good, new year, new people, and also same people because our class are still rocking it and we're still doing amazing. And yeah, let's see, <laughs> let's see how second year goes because ooh, 
Oh my god, is the work difficult? Obviously, as we move into term three, we'll actually be going into our priority week for small sword and also knife and doing a couple other things here and there, which I will get to in videos yet to come. But I guess as of now, this is gonna be a short video of me just saying, I'm very sorry that I haven't given you a video in a while. Second year has hit me really hard and I've really been trying to get to grips with the work and all of the workload has been a lot and I really wanna give you a lot more content. So we're gonna be bringing some more vlogs onto the channel Channel, some more interviews and more Q&A's with past and previous students and students on other courses so please stay alert for that we're gonna come back bring some more videos and I hope you enjoy them but yes I'm gonna sign off here so can I please ask a massive favor and please like share and subscribe to my channel it means a massive amount to me if you could share the information with your friends if they are interested in applying for acting a stage combat at East 15 or just interested in applying for East 15 in general send them over to the channel if you have any requests for videos or videos that you would like to see, I'll do a couple of Q and A's on Instagram and polls, but please just send me a DM. If there's a video that you wanna see or information that you wanna know about East 15, just send me a DM. Just send me a DM on my Instagram and you know, my inbox is always open. I know I'm very busy, but I'll get back to you as soon as I can. So yeah, with that being said, I am gonna sign off for now. Thank you very much for joining me. Have a good day.